Good evening, welcome to the Daily Office, and thanks for joining me. This is Night Prayer for Thursday, April the 23rd. It's the third week in Easter, and week two in our psalm cycle, and the scripture for this service, Psalm 37, verse 34 to 40, and 1 John chapter 5, verse 13 to 21. And please join me in singing the fifth verse of Psalm 95 with the Easter Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Forty years I endured that generation. I said they are a people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall never enter into my rest. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Our help is in the name of God Most High, the Maker of heaven and earth. Let us confess our sins to God. Together, O oh, merciful God, we have sinned through our own fault in our thoughts and words and deeds, and in what we have failed to do. We have not loved you with our whole hearts. We have not loved our neighbor as ourselves. We beseech you overlook our faults and cast our sins behind your back, that we may serve you and praise you all the days of our lives. Amen. And may Almighty and merciful God grant us forgiveness of all our sins, and the grace and the comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O oh God, come to my assistance, make haste to help me. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia, wait on the Most High and keep God's way, and God will free you from the wicked. Alleluia. Psalm 37, please recite together with me. Alleluia, wait on the Most High and keep God's way, and God will free you from the wicked, and you will inherit the land. When the wicked are destroyed, you shall see it. I have seen the wicked triumphant, spreading themselves like a green bay tree. And yet they passed away. I sought them, but they could not be found. Mark the just and see the upright, for their end is peaceful. But the sinners shall be destroyed together. They have no future. The Most High saves the righteous. God is their strength in time of trouble. The Most High shall help them and deliver them. God shall deliver them from the wicked and save them, because they trust in God. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia, wait on the Most High and keep God's way. God will free you from the wicked. Alleluia. A lesson from the first letter of John, chapter 5, beginning at verse 13. I write these things to you who believe in the name of the Son of God, so that you may know that you have eternal life. And this is the boldness that we have in him, that if we ask anything according to his will, he hears us. And if we know that he hears us in whatever we ask, we know that we have obtained the request made of him. If you see your brother or sister committing what is not a mortal sin, you will ask and God will give life to such a one, to those whose sin is not mortal. There is sin that is mortal. I do not say that you should pray about that. All wrongdoing is sin, but there is sin that is not mortal. We know that those who are born of God do not sin, but the one who was born of God protects them, and the evil one does not touch them. 
we know that we are God's children and that the whole world lies under the power of the evil one. And we know that the Son of God has come and has given us understanding so that we may know him who is true. And we are in him who is true, in his Son, Jesus Christ. He is the true God and eternal life. Little children, keep yourself from idols. Here ends the lesson. Into your hands I commend my spirit, for you have redeemed me, O God of truth. Keep us as the apple of your eye. Hide us under the shadow of your wings. Together. Our beloved, which art in heaven, holy is your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us as we forgive others. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Let us pray. O oh God, turn us away from evil and into the paths of good. Deliver us from the wicked and grant us peace in our day. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Bless Jesus, my soul, and may the Almighty and merciful God, the source of all being, eternal Word and Holy Spirit, bless us and keep us now and forever. Amen. Amen.